In this one, I want to show you how to add text over video in iMovie on the iPhone. So I'm going to get the app open and I have a project that I'm already working on. So I'm going to go ahead and just open this one and edit it. And as you can see, I have this video cut up into three different sections because what I want to actually do is essentially add subtitles that will change and adding text over each of these. So what you have to do is first highlight one of the sections of video and then you can come down to the options at the bottom which appear and use the T option which is for text. And there are some different text options within iMovie on the iPhone. So if you scroll through them, definitely some uh, different designs and also different animations as well. And there's not a massive selection here, but they're decent enough. And actually the first option there is usually very good for subtitles. You can actually click on any of them to see a preview of what they would be. So if you click through, you can see what it is like and choose which one is best. For me, adding subtitles, the first option is best. It's in the bottom left-hand corner, looks pretty good. It's a good size overall. So what I want to do to edit that now is to touch the text on the screen. So touching it comes up with essentially the editing tool and I can now edit this in any way that I want. And I just want to add some subtitles, whatever it may be. When I'm done, I press the done button and that subtitle is now finished. Because this is an auto feature, these subtitles actually fade in and out. So if I go back to the very start of that clip and then press play, as you can see, it's right there. This was great. And then as it moves on to the other clip, I now don't have any text here. So I can click on that clip again, add that, change the title itself to something else whatever it may be, press done, and that is also finished. Now, if I go back to the front, as you can see, the first subtitle is now there. This was great. Then it will fade in and out to the next title and so on. You can do that over and over again throughout your whole project. There are some other options which I'll quickly go through that uh, definitely are good to know. The first is that you can change the position of the text down at the bottom, there are some options here. So if you double click the box that is surrounded in blue, and then so the options will come up. You can have closing, which moves it to the right, opening, which moves it to the left, and middle, which moves it just in a slightly different position for that particular text. That can happen with all of these. So each of these options and uh, texts can be changed in some different ways. You can go through and just see all the different designs. Another really important thing to note is the option for sound down at the bottom. So when the text comes on screen, it can be silent if it's crossed out or it can actually make a sound. So for right now, this has no sound. As you can hear, there's no sound of the text, but you can change it to having sound. Each of these you can change. And then when the text comes in and out, it will actually make a noise. It's kind of odd for this one, but it is an option that's there. So certainly something to watch out for. Anyway, that is adding text onto video using iMovie on the iPhone. I hope it was helpful. If it was, please give the video a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one.